am Maria Garcia de Freire. On May 13, 1917, the Virgin Mary appeared to three little shepherds, Lucia, Francisco, and Jacinta, in Fatima, Portugal, and asked them to pray the rosary daily, do prayer and penance for sinners, and go every 13th of the month until the month of October, where she would perform a great miracle. On June 13, 1917, in her second apparition at Fatima, Our Lady showed her heart to the three little shepherds and said to Lucia, Jesus wants to use you to make me known and loved. He wants to establish the devotion to my immaculate heart in the world. To whoever embraces her, I promise salvation, and these souls will be loved by God like little flowers placed by me to adorn his throne. Again, in the third apparition at Fatima on July 13, 1917, Our Lady showed them hell and told them, You have seen hell, where the souls of poor sinners go. To save them, God wants to establish devotion to Immaculate Heart in the world. If what I tell you is done, many souls will be saved and there will be peace. You at least try to console me and announce in my name. I will come to ask for the consecration of Russia to my Immaculate Heart and the reparative communion of the first Saturdays. On October 13, the apparitions ended. That day, more than 70,000 people witnessed what is known as the Dance of the Sun. Just as Our Lady told them, Francisco and Jacinta died shortly after, and Lucia remained alive. She went to the convent of the Sisters Dorotea in Pontevedra, Spain, and there, on December 10, 1925, the Holy Virgin, having the child Jesus at her side on a luminous cloud, appeared to Sister Lucia in her cell. Putting his hand on her shoulder, he showed her a heart surrounded by thorns. The child Jesus, pointing to it, said to Lucia, Be sorry for the heart of your Blessed Mother, which is surrounded by thorns because of all the men who ungrateful and constantly stick pains without anyone doing any act of reparation to remove them. And the Virgin Mary added, Look, my daughter, my heart surrounded by thorns that ungrateful men at every moment stick into me with blasphemies and ingratitudes. Do at least do something to console me and say that to all those who for five months on the first Saturday confess, receive Holy Communion, pray the Rosary, and accompany me for 15 minutes, meditating on the rose mysteries of the Rosary to make amends to me. I promise to assist you at the hour of your death with all the graces necessary for your salvation. Why five Saturdays for the five types of blasphemies with which our Lord is offended and Our Lady is offended and which she herself revealed to Sister Lucia, blasphemies against her Immaculate Heart, blasphemies against her virginity, against her as Mother of God and Mother of Humanity, blasphemies of those who publicly instill in children indifference, contempt, and even hatred to the Blessed Virgin, blasphemy of those who violate their sacred images. Friends, let us continue the messages of Our Lady of Fatima to Sister Lucia, especially the devotion to the first five Saturdays for five months. On the first Saturday, confess, receive Holy Communion, pray the Rosary, accompany her for 15 minutes, meditating on her mysteries in order to make amends, because she is the Mother of God, and with God we always win.